<laughs> Listen, many people who used today to mock you will cry tomorrow for your sake. <laughs> yes, you need to wait to the end of this video. Yes, I know that we are living in a world where people will, will be like a, a, a the situation of today classified or, or identify what tomorrow will be. But the truth is this, brother. Many people who have mocked you with your present situation right now, many people who have already, you know, concluded you as a failure, who have looked down on you, who have already made up their mind that nothing good will come out of you, that you won't be able to succeed, you won't be able to make it, you won't do it the way you will do it. You will come to a point where you will start to live a good life, live expensive life, live nice. Many of them, tomorrow, they will cry. <laughs> Hey God, because when God, when God opened that door that is about to open in your life, <laughs> those who speak bad of you will join you to celebrate. <laughs> Believe me, all those people who have mocked and tell you, eh, is it not you? Eh, eh, nothing good will come out of you. Believe me, soon and later, soon and later, very, very soon, a lot of them who have spoke all this manners of word a lot of them who have made all this decree on your behalf you know making mockery on, on you speaking evil on you telling you one thing to another just to do what just to make you feel like this is what is real i'm here to tell you many of them will soon regret why they ever ever make mockery of you why they ever mock you with your present situation <laughs> the truth is this, we have a lot of people who mock us secretly, who laugh at us secretly, who don't believe that something good will come out of us, who all their wishes is that where we are today, we will we, we, we be in, ten, in two to three years to come. But believe me, many of them are going to cry because what they used to laugh at you today, we do what we laugh at them tomorrow. <laughs> Look at the brothers of Joseph. Joseph was mocked, humiliated, sold, and at the end, when he met the brothers, he said to them, what you made for good, God is using it for my own lifting. God turned it for my own good. What you people made for evil. So my brothers, many people who have made evil for you, who have did one thing to another, sabotage you, talk shit on your name, say all manners of evil word against you, go some places to destroy you, many of them will soon regret why they ever ever messed up with you yes they have maybe they have mocked you secretly or publicly M maybe someone have tell you the way do people do used to tell me those days ah something you can't be able to work you are too small you can't do nothing you 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 can't do it without us you can't do this without us you can't be this you can't be that but i'm here to tell you brothers many of those people who have disappointed you i'm not talking about those who don't have Maybe they promise and at the end they don't have to fulfill. I'm talking about those who, who disappointed you when they have it. They, just, they don't just want you to grow. They want you to be in a position where you will always be depending on them. Listen, tomorrow many of them will, 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 do what? will cry. <laughs> they will cry because your, the door of God will open for you. The door that God will open for you will shock a lot of people. That door that God will open will make a lot of people regret why they ever turned down on you. Why they ever looked down on you. Why they ever concluded you as a failure. Why they ever finalized that nothing good will come out of you. A lot of people are going to do a secretly pass different word pain for making you feel like you are you are mad for nothing <laughs> you know <what> I'm saying <laughs> all those people who have laughed you with your with your with your situation that with your difficulties with pain with delay with all those people who have mocked and look at you and said hey you this this will not you can't be this you can't be that you can't be this you can't get married you can't have a, a good relationship you can't get a good marriage no no man is coming to marry you no no woman is coming to marry you no one will accept you not even in their lifetime you will succeed not even in that in their lifetime you will get married not even in their lifetime you will pros you will do what you will prosper the same way god did to jezebel that is the same way God will allow them to use their own hands to kill yourself. Believe me, 
because no man on earth can battle with God. That those who swell and knock on their chest and said, Not in their lifetime will you succeed. <laughs> Listen, they will see the goodness of God and they will never join to eat it. Believe me, there was a story of two men who were arguing, saying, Oh man, so forth. But a prophet, I'm sure Elisha, Elijah, he declared, He said, You will see it, but you won't enter it. So either don't know who has spoken word behind you or, 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 or after you, who has spoken evil word, negative word. But that God who disappoints Jezebel, that the same God will disappoint them. <laughs> you know what I'm saying? So they mock you with your present situation. But God will use your, what, your, your lifting up to mock them. You know what I'm saying? That those who have laughed at you, who have made mockery of you, will regret why they ever do so. Forget about what you are facing today now. Forget about people who have left you, who refuse to support you. Because when God opened that door that I'm seeing that is about to open in your life, when God opened that door, those who mock at you, your sources, your breakthrough, your greatness, your achievement, will do what will shock them out. Remember, bless me, God bless you.